Hey, welcome to Say Nado. Let's go up to the barn garage and see what Victor's into today. I wanted to show you an example of changing the timeout timer on the Tenergy T180 when doing the hybrid battery modules. Now, this one, <clears throat> I'd set the timer at 320 and it quit at 8,808 milliamps. This one, the timer was set at 340 and it did indeed stop at 340. One thing I definitely say about the Tenergy T180, if you set the time to stop, time out, safety time out at a certain time, it will stop at that certain time. What I'm looking for here is consistency in how many MAH it'll try to push into one of these modules before it times out. So you can prevent it from pushing too much, trying to push too much MAH into one of these modules and doing a runaway charge like I did when I maxed it out at 720. So none of these are maxed out at 720. That one's obviously 320 with 8,808 MAH. This one was set at 340. It had stopped at 340 and it had pushed 9,945 MAH. This one was set at 350 and it stopped at 10,533 MAH. But here, and that seems to be pretty consistent. The longer you set the timer, the more MAH it'll try to push into that module. But then you get results like this right here on Curly. He's being a bad boy again. About 320 minutes pushed 9,456 MAH. That's a little different from Mo over here that did 300, the same 320 minutes and only 8,808 MAH. And that 9,456 is really close to what happened here. It's a little bit less than what happened here. 9,945 MAH at 340 minutes, which was 20 minutes longer. So there's definitely something going on with the, the difference in capacity for the module itself. And that means we're still pretty much a, a bit of a guessing game on where to set the time the safety timer because some modules need more time these are all set at two amps As some modules need more time to absorb the mah than others and not only are they they uh not only are they all under compression but i do have a fan here that's working really well link in the description and it's you know it's keeping them all nice and cool so the only explanation i can think of here is that you know they're in different conditions since mo and curly were both set at 320 minutes and got different mah we can at least look at what the tenor gt180 says their resistance is it says this one's 18 M milliohms resistance, and it pushed 8,808 milliamps in 320 minutes. That was during the charge cycle, by the way. And it says this one is 12 milliohms resistance. So more resistance. and less resistance. So that would seem to indicate that the resistance in the module has something to do with how many MAH, because this one pushed more MAH, and this one pushed less. This one had more resistance. This one had less resistance. So maybe that's the explanation of why it got more MAH in the same amount of time. So I just wanted to share that with all you guys that are experimenting with newer and better ways of reconditioning the hybrid modules. 
if you're not open minded and you're set in your ways and you think you know everything there is to know about reconditioning modules and you don't care about hearing my crap, fine. Um, I don't have a problem with that. I think that I and all the other people listening here that are willing to admit they don't know everything and they're willing to experiment a little bit and try to learn or at least listen to other people's experiments because I do not recommend you do your own experiments. Uh, I'm doing this at my own risk. I know this could literally blow up in my face at any moment. Or I could shock the crap out of myself. I might wake up in the hospital again or not wake up at all. <laughs> this is dangerous. Make no mistake about it. But then so is working on stuff full of gasoline. Or covered in gasoline. So don't do what I do. Don't even do things that I talk about. Because I've been getting burnt, bruised, and bleeding all my life. If you're doing these things at your own risk, please comment below. Share what you've learned, uh, your opinions, your thoughts. Uh, try to back it up with a few facts <laughs> if you can. Uh, if you've got photos, videos, stuff like that, Sane Auto Facebook page. On the Facebook, it's Sane Auto with a space in between. It's not one word like it is here on the YouTube. If you think we should change it to Insane Auto, then let us know in the comments. As a matter of fact, better yet, Make a, your own video on your own channel. Why Saint Auto should be Insane Auto. Escape and better get your cycle data before you hit escape. Because once you hit escape, all that data is gone. All right. I had it set for one, one cycle. I'm going to escape again. You see the NIMH I had it set for. I've got to go over here to setup. Setup. And at the bottom of this first page is where the safety timer is. Hit that and go down. Three twenty. Hit enter. Then escape. And keep going. Get back to, whoop, past it, NIMH. And then I've got to decide which module I'm going to put this on and whether I'm going to cycle it, charge it, or discharge, and all that kind of stuff. With the Tenergy listing that I'm linked to in the description of this video, where you can find one of these, says that this does not do, or that at least it says that these are not made to do this. Which brings me to another point that I should tell you, don't do anything you see me do in my videos. Don't even do anything I talk about in my videos. I've woke up in the hospital more than a few times wondering why I'm still alive. Cables, it does come with cables, lots of different cables, but it doesn't come with these cables. And these are working out great for doing with this, what this ain't supposed to do. Lots more shenanigans like this in our hybrid repair playlist. Lots more stuff about the T180 repair playlist as well hey if you like this video we've got a whole lot more we've got full reviews we've got repair videos we've got show car videos hot rods mod rods you name it if it's got wheels on it and an engine it's probably on this channel so subscribe like and binge watch, 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 watch.